Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rain to episode 7 and 8 of Lee Courage Recoil. So let's go ahead and get started with episode 7 and 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, nice music start. Yes, good. I like it. <laughs> no, 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 no. She saw us a little close. I mean, how she drawn him. She did him hella pretty, too. <laughs> Oh my god, yeah, he is pretty. He pretty. His hair isn't that <laughs> green. It's more like a light lime-ish. <laughs> you know what I was sitting here thinking about? Well, okay, so between these last couple of weeks I'm getting into the show and I'm thinking of Chisato more as a character and such. Okay. Now, this kind of, to me, last week when I got, when I saw the last two episodes, it kind of really confirmed it in my mind and such. Uh, okay. So we know the relationship between her, herself, and the guy who saved her and how she has a, you know, animatronic heart and such. Like, you know, it's, it's not an actual heart and shit like that. He must have did something else to make her like invincible she she's very superhuman ish she's very hand good at her hand eye coordination and how this girl if a bullet you know comes straight for her how she can pass that ish easy no no regular human can do that no regular human can do that except what's his face in the matrix that's it so you know hey right here superhuman Chisato, honey, that's what you are. Yes. Yes, we are put, we are locking in this answer today on the 13th of December at 9.20 in the evening on my mom's birthday. Yes, we are doing that. Mm -hmm, she's superhuman. So we'll find out in a couple of weeks. <laughs> kind of hungry again. See, that's what I want. I mean, after the day I had today, it's only Tuesday. I am tired. I want some alcohol. It would be so nice, but you know I can't. Maybe on Friday, yes. Nope. Thursday night. Hmm? 
Exactly, that's an invasion of privacy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I'm talking now. <laughs> True. No, I mean, but you know, hey. <laughs> mm -mm. Chill, but no. <laughs> Jesus, that was her? See, yeah, once again, super, superhuman. Red fucking eyes in this. Child, what is wrong with you? Sorry, that's cute. He gets mad. They're about to kill the police officer. Dang, he, you know, he just here for his regular, you know, like, 9 to 5, 5 to 9. Oh, they're not toys. 
Can a toy do this? <laughs> Damn. Damn. Like, he, he was just trying to get his money. Bruh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, my God. Oh. Just because you're on duty doesn't mean you need to ha like can't have a break. Damn. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Only the care color, baby. <laughs> oh damn <laughs> okay so are we tailing him mm -hmm. we follow him right <laughs> Stretching, yes. <laughs> okay, go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, she was so cute. <laughs> 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 They're going on a date. Mm -hmm. My God, it's not a date. Mm -hmm. It's not a date. Oh, my God. Thank you. 
Oh, wait. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. It's not like that. Oh, watch him not come back. He's not going to come back. Oh. Oh. He's still suspicious to me. Like, mm-mm. It's complicated, babe. Mm-hmm. 
Ain't that a little weird, though, how she's not here yet? Yes. Okay, one, hold up. All right, all right, all right. Let's talk about this. Okay. Now that Chisato knows the secret and the thing between her and Yoshi, like, I was expecting her to not only lash out at Mika, but to be a little, not two-faced, but, like, be some type of way towards both Yoshi and Mika. Because, like, I mean, yeah, two, two people kept a secret about you for a really long time. And they did it for your protection. I get it. It's a, it's always we're doing it for you your sake. For your protection. Da 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 da. This is that and the third. But still at the same time you're doing more harm than none and such. Even more. And so then of course someone is gonna feel some type of way, be like, Hey yo, like mm mm. If you if you lied to me about this, what else have you lied to me about? Right? Let's be a little smart about that. But I'm happy that she knows. I mean, I expected her to come in, you know, a little doom and gloom. But no, I love how she kind of, she, necessarily she didn't really brush it off. But, you know, she's just like accepting it. And that's okay. I'm fine with that. Yes, that was good. I mean, hell, you know, it's an interesting episode. But something just tells me. Oh. He has one too? Wait. 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 Wait! We're destroying another fucking tower, oh my god. Okay. Okay. Mm. T time out, time out, time out. Okay. The fact that, you know, we all knew that since day one, since we met you, Sacha, the, the cute little owl necklace, you know, mm, yes, adorable, cute as fuck, love it. But the fact that he also has one, too? Sir, okay, hold on. All right, all right. Let's go ahead and go ahead and confirm this, too. Let's make a little educated guess on this, too. All right. So now, okay, is the connection also between these two is that they were both tested by Yoshi and, quote, unquote, saved by Yoshi? Because that's got to be something. I, I, I don't know. That's the only thing that I can really, truly think of as of right now because what else could it be? Yes, they ha their destinies are really intertwined to with each other because of the fact is they, 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 they first saw each other 
or knew of each other the one day at the time when the radio tower got blown up and maybe Chisato had to be at least like what nine ten years old still had to be like a kid at the time and still superhuman af and <laughs> in middle school kicking ass <laughs> with a gun <laughs> and being this complete you know like perfect AI robot even though I don't think she is in a robot or anything but she has the, her, her little superhuman tendencies and how she can do certain things and then you look at all the other girls and be like can you do that too no I can't do that You'd be like all right this girl really special over here so does he have something as well that was taken away from him that got him a, a second chance at life but okay, no, 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 no. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me put, let me put my other thinking cap on. Okay, let's go back to last week's episode, right? All right, the fight between these two. Remember when he got like um his face covered with blood, and how he was so good at like you know not well almost predicting Chisato's moves and everything, and able to like be like match her one to one and some shit brother oh like you can't do that unless you were blind was he blind come on (laughs) if i swear to god if i'm right (laughs) because like honestly think about that shit Think about that because he, because I'm sitting here, I was like, and then I'm at work the next day and I'm really sitting thinking about it. I'm like, even though like I had no customers in the store, I'm just sitting in the back and I'm thinking about the fight again and I'm like, something about that don't make sense. I was like, but, but he can see. So what? Huh? Explain. And and then of course, I already, I can imagine it right now when the Patreons see this on Saturdays, how you doing and such. Everybody's going to be watching this and they're going to be like, oh, I I can't say this because of that. And I can't say this because of this. And I'm just going to be over here like, you know, you could say something without spoiling. I I mean, yeah, you could say yes or yeah, you could say no. Or you could be like, Deja, I can't answer that question until we get up to episode whatever. So yeah, say that. Deja, I can't get, I can't answer that question until we get to this episode. That will satisfy me. Even though I feel like it won't. But it should. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That will satisfy me until I get to that episode. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. But okay, also, like, the yaoi, like, that the little hint... Oh, was not expecting that today. I mean, because like I, when I look at Yoshi and Mika, I'm I'm like I don't see it like that. But then in that moment, be like, oh, we're going there! Oh my god, yeah! Because <laughs> I really mean where Yaoi in my life, like, bra. <laughs> the last Yaoi I watched, oh my god, some good ass Yaoi. Yes, I mean, because like here with this show, you're giving me my Yuri moments and such. And I love it, even though, like I said, when we watch the first two episodes, like, we, we, I know that they don't get together. But in my mind, they get together. They're endgame. They're, they got married and such. Just as much as, um, Miku and freaking, um, oh my god, what is your name? What's your name? I know your name. What's your, we're gonna look it up. I gotta cheat. <laughs> <laughs> What's your name? I know your freaking name. Hold on. It's like literally on. Hibiki! Hibiki! <laughs> I don't know how I got that to me, but it came. Just like Miku and Misu. <laughs> Hibiki, wrong character. <laughs> how they're married. That's it. Period. End game. End game. End motherfucking game. That's it. So however how this series ends in the next couple of weeks for me, they're end game. Nothing can hurt my heart for them. No, you can't destroy it. Uh, that's it. Mm-mm, mm-mm. End game. End game. Go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 8. Alrighty, episode 8 in 3, 2, 1, go. 
Oh, there's that one drink that I all the freaking sparkling water that I always thought was alcohol. <laughs> That I feel like he's going to die today. I mean, because, you know, we start the episode with him. So. He ain't gonna have her go out and murder Chisato or something. Or, no, take her away. And also, isn't that a little too much, babe? Huh. That's me. Yeah, me and my money issues. It's like, yes, oh my god, I, I have money. Let me buy whatever the fuck I want. And then, you know, <laughs> you gotta do bills. <laughs> And this is why you have to budget. <laughs> I mean, okay, because like, here's, a, here's a funny thing. So I know I had to pay my Amazon bill today. And then I think the weekend this comes out um, for Patreons, what is the Saturday date? Yes. That Saturday, I gotta pay my Crunchyroll bill and such. But, you know, because, see, here's the one thing. And I'll be honest, like, okay, I oversplurged on my birthday month because, okay, birthday month, you know, <laughs> that's when you're like, I'm gonna buy everything for me. But you know how when someone, you, okay, you know that saying on Parks and Rec where, like, what's the space is like, treat yourself? I took that and I ran with that ish. Almost every single time when I got paid, I did save money, but at the same time, I did treat myself. Like, I was like, Psh, I want this. I had to buy, like, I bought this for my birthday, and then my mom's for her's birthday, but she got that earlier. Then my mom's Christmas gift is over there. My Christmas gift to myself is right there. Um, even though I'm probably not really going to use it as much because I have a, you know, PS5. And, you know, PS5 is my jam and such. I have more games for that than the other system. That is really for me and my friends when they want to play something together. But yeah! Still, more of the story. Budget! Your money! <laughs> <laughs> That's like how I want to buy a whole bunch of anime merch and then you're like, oh. <laughs> 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 the chip be talking about. <laughs> She's right. It's already done. No! <sighs> well, that is the, you know, beauty of a former music art.
G g give me the money. Psh, give me the money. Damn. <laughs> no. I mean, it's cute. It's a miracle. Because <laughs> she loved the compliments. <laughs> Mizuki is literally me at work and Mika is my boss and it's just like alright I'm coming I'm like oh my god and the next thing you know I'm like Right. No. And she did it all in a little devil's costume. Oh, good numbers, good numbers. <laughs> See, 
treat yourself. Yes! It's the best thing in the world. Nice. It really all looking at the stock market? Oh my god. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, baby, you wasn't supposed to see that. That, no, don't, don't flush it. Oh my god, no. Is she at home? Oh! Hello? What happened? What? <laughs> See, gorgeous, gorgeous baby. We love her. She's so pretty. My talking to us. <laughs> It is so weird. Oh my god. These two are just being buddies. Oh my god. You want alcohol? Water?
<laughs> like a little badass. Oh my god. Well, but you are a monster, though. <laughs> oh my god, fucking ten out of ten. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, because mm -hmm. here comes talking up. <laughs> yeah, how do you explain that? <laughs> I mean, he has super hearing. <laughs> but he has to be. Mm -hmm. Lies. Lion. Oh, it's hugging us. Yes, because she's your wife, honey. Of course. Baby.
<laughs> yes. Bitch, what the fuck you put in the damn needle? No, because she got drugs inside of her and now she's going to be taken away. Probably for testing. Oh, that's what she's going to do. Mm. To save her wife. Okay, so whatever they're going to do to, uh, I'm about to say Takina, to Sato's heart, we're not going to find that out until next week. Okay. 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 I just need to know what the fuck it is. I can't wait till next week. <laughs> I might be hella busy next week to record, plus next week is Christmas. Oh my god. Okay. Um, these two episodes were good. Seeing our two, our, our protagonist and our antagonist literally in a scene together, just like talking and being friendly with each other is it's interesting it's different i've ne well have i seen another anime do that before i don't think so well kind of i mean you know because you you can kind of count it with kogi yas with like lelouch and um suzaku in a way but i mean yeah but that is, that is different. It really is interesting to see those two and to just be like, okay, let's kind of be buddy-buddy with each other. But it's like, you know, <laughs> it'd be like, Leslie, didn't you try to kill me? Didn't we fight and you beat the shit out of me and you want me to be buddy-buddy with you this week? Bro, what? What? Like, that's why I was like, couldn't, thinking to myself, couldn't be me. Be like, hold on. You wanna, you kicked my behind last week, and now you wanna be buddy-buddy this week. How, what you gonna be next week? Are you just gonna be, like, ghosting me too? Like, bruh. And, and now that, like, you know, talking to the worried wife is like, okay, something's wrong with my wife. My wife ain't answering. I gotta go find her. Of course, like, immediately she's gonna go to him and be like, where the fuck is my wife? Da -da 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 -da. Here's the funny thing, and I keep forgetting this because, of course, it they're both done by the same damn company. When I was looking at, like, the more and more that I look at, like, any picture of Takina and how in the previous episode where I said, oh my god, she looks like Rin from fucking Idol Master Cinema the Girls. Duh, it was made by the same dang studio. So, of course, they was like, here, we're going to take one of the best girls from Cinderella Girls and then, you know, just make her even more like this. And, and then talking it was weird. <laughs> that is all. Because I'm, I'm sitting here and I'm like, in the previous episode, I'm like, yeah, oh, she looks like Rip in the back. And then I'm like sitting here, I'm like, wait, 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 wait. Was the Cinderella Girls also made by A1 Pictures? And I'm like, I think so, yes. But I mean, <laughs> if you literally, I'm probably about to go on Twitter after I'm done recording. Um, summertime, but like, yes, look at these two pictures of these two girls. They're the same. They are the same. You, you cannot tell, like, I'm literally going to do that, and I'm going to post that if, for this post uh, on Saturday, and you'll be like, yeah, look at these two. They look the same. They are the same. You cannot tell me that they are not the same. But, I mean, okay, so here, here's my thing with, um, we're, I'm still calling him Kitty Toe, I don't give a fuck, with him. He, he's, he's very, like, hit or miss with Yoshi and, and the institution and stuff like that. 
Um, and it has to also be something else with Chisato. And so he's over, like, Chisato is over here, like, saying, well, you know, these people helped me, so I, I'm on this path of let me repay them, let me do the goodness of my heart, let me be good. While with him, he's more like, okay, these guys are still the bad guys, even though I'm technically, what I'm doing I th is what I think is right. So he's technically not only a bad guy, but he's a good guy. But it's just like the way, the route he's going to get what he wants and the outcome, which is terrorism, aka the T word and such, it's the bad route. So he is still making himself look like a bad guy. Where where it's like, there, there are points, it's very similar like how I was the first time when I watched Death Note. And, and it's so funny because every single time when I watch either Death Note or Code Geass, I, like, my mind and how I, I was the first time I watched it, even during now, like, it, it always changes. Especially when I watched it with my mom, even though my mom has not seen Code Geass. It's kind of almost like, like, it's kind of, uh, I cannot speak. It's kind of almost like how I was when I watched Dorara for the first time, where it's like, you... Everyone, like, one minute you're, like, you're cheering for the good guys and then you're cheering for the bad guys. So, like, when you watch Death Note for the first time, you're cheering, obviously, for Light. But then at the same time, you're cheering for L. But then, you know, there th once again, this me. I was always cheering for Light Yagami. And I was like, fuck L and such. And then it was kind of the same thing with Nier and Ish. And then with Kogias, I was, at, no, Kogias was kind of a little different for me. I was half and half. I was both, like standing like really like into what Lelouch meant and stuff even though everybody was like no 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 I da, 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 and everybody had their points and then you had to also agree with Suzaku because you know A A B C and it's going back and forth between and such and there it's like still even now there is or no there is no right or wrong answer you can still agree with some of the things that both of those two antagonists of their respectable series did but maybe like you still don't have to support them that's the biggest thing and it, and it seems like he's doing the same thing where it's like i'm looking at him and i'm like okay i like you I understand the things that you are doing because you want to do this because you feel like this is right and this is what you need to do as a character. Like I said, he's not a bad villain. He's actually a really good villain. Damn, he might be number one for me on the villains for this year. Um, but damn. I mean, seriously, damn. I, I was not expecting it to like, e even though, even where we are, still not expecting it to go that way. Because like, this show, especially with the fact is that I am, like, very close to the end, this show can end any freaking way. It really can. And honestly, once again, I am scared to know how the fuck this damn show ends. But other than that, guys, that is where I actually be towards episode 7 and 8 of The Chorus Recoil. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every time I join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially. Okay. Here, I think this is what we're going to do because I'm not 100% sure if I will do this. So, um, we all know that by the time this comes out on Saturday, it'll be Christmas. Um, or no, it'll be the day before Christmas. Um, no, oh my god, what the fuck am I saying? It'll be the week before Christmas and then for everybody else, it'll be the week of Christmas. Um, I'm not 100% sure if I will watch the next two episodes of this and po in both Summertime Burn Night. If I do, instead of me having it come out the following Saturday, aka the 24th, I might have it come out on the, what's the freaking day after the 24th? The 31st, so on New Year's and stuff. Um... Which would be better because then, I mean, because like, even though technically, because you all know, like, on the 24th, that's when Bochi is ending, Bochi and Spy Family is officially ending, like, the last few shows that I'll have left for summer, I mean, summer, the fuck, <laughs> um, fall anime besides Pretty Cure, because of course Pretty Cure doesn't end until, like, February, like, hmm, yeah, first, first two weeks of February. Um, so I probably won't have, like, my definitive answer until this weekend because I really have to think about it for the next couple of days. Um, but I might be smart and let's say if I don't do it, I will still possibly record those episodes and then still so that the week of the 25th to the 31st, I don't have to stress about it 
with the fact that I have to go back to work and this is that third because you know what hell if you haven't if you don't even know this now you know the last two episodes of Bleach they're being smart and they're having it be one freaking hour long and I'm over here I might have to go back to work on Monday the day after Christmas and I don't really want that to happen but yes um you'll find out this weekend but um if you for for everyone if you don't see anything next Saturday just know the following week but yeah until then i will see you guys all next time bye